Hello everyone. So there was a question on the community. Interesting question. And I thought I'll uh, talk about it and uh, share the possibility. Now the question is about uh, column names and using column names in a JQL. Now when we create uh, a board in Jira, we have the option to of course create these columns and uh, these columns are uh, associated with the uh, different uh, statuses. For example, if you look at this board, in my board, I have uh, columns like uh, to do in progress and review and done. And if you go to the board settings, you can see that these columns are actually mapped to one or multiple uh, statuses. For example, you can see here that my in review is mapped to in review, in progress is, is mapped to in progress, to do is mapped to to do an on hold, maybe on hold should probably go somewhere, maybe here, let us say. Now, if you look at this situation now, in progress has two statuses. Now, you may want to search based on these statuses, but un unfortunately, uh, you can't really do that. Maybe Atlassian has plans uh, for this, but I don't really think that they will do it. So in this case, in such situations, your best option is to combine these statuses. For example, you can do something like status in and you can say on hold or uh, yep on hold come on on hold and uh, maybe the other one was in progress so when you combine these uh, statuses you can then use uh, of course you know this jql and uh, maybe use it somewhere on your dashboard but unfortunately we don't really have anything like uh, column or uh, board uh, board columns. So I thought I'll probably talk about it because uh, this can be confusing in case you are trying to use Jira for the very first time. All right, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new. Thank you very much. Bye bye.